This is a set of data where you're looking at the amount of food supplement given to a chicken and the hardness of its egg. So what you want to do before you do a line fit is check if there's a correlation between the two things. This allows, correlation is a yes, no question. Are they correlated? Are they not correlated? And are they correlated to a significant level? You should always do a correlation before you do regression, which is actually fitting a line so that you can model y from the x. So in this case, go to analyze and you go to correlation. Now it's bivariate because there are two variables that you want to compare. Correlation is almost always bivariate. So we'll pick bivariate, I'll pick food and hardness. Now there are multiple ways of calculating correlation coefficients. If your data is normally distributed, you use the Pearson's correlation. If it is not normally distributed, then you can use the Spearman's rank or row calculation. In this case, we pick those and press OK. So what you will end up with is two tables. So here's the Pearson table. So first you've got food compared to food. Well, they're perfectly correlated because it's the same variable. You've got food and its relationship to hardness. So this is saying that the Pearson's correlation is 0 0.994. It has two stars beside it, showing that this is a highly significant correlation. Below that, you have the p-value. This p-value is reading zero, but it's actually just less than 0 0.0005. Anything larger than that would round to 0 0.001. If I look at the non-parametric version, again, got a correlation of one between food and food. In this case, the correlation of food to hardness is 0 0.983. Still highly significant, but a slightly smaller correlation than the non than the parametric Pearson's method, but still the significance is below 0 0.005 as a threshold. It's vanishingly small. So in this case, there's a very strong correlation between the food supplement given and the hardness of the eggs. And it's a highly significant difference.